first of all, let me start by saying a big salute to Scribble Media and thank you for coming through and uh, helping shine a light on what we was doing back here. You know, so here we are for round two. So, you know, first time you were here, we were under construction. You back again, we under construction again. A lot of growth. And, you know, you about to, you about to really turn this into something New York has never seen, probably the world has never seen. So, I'm excited just to bring y'all along for the process because y'all coming back again, too. You heard Scribble Media, we're going to be beginning, middle, and all that. Day one, that's what we're doing. Show the world, you know, what we can do. All talents get together. We like some grown ass kids building you a ghetto Disneyland, man. There you go. Stay tuned. Like you Jesus understand says, what's happening street. right now? <laughs> this is about the this is history for, for the dumps. You gotta see, you know, high energy, high nerves because I'm excited. Y'all literally about to watch the process in fast speed, right? This is about to take us three months to do. This is day one of construction. Day one, La Vega Studio. Collaborating with, you know, some of the most incredible artists, music, business, you know, art itself. You know, it's, it's been a, a, a plethora of opportunity and relationships with really, really dope people. And there's so much going on. I don't want to leave nobody out because in so many different facets of things, you know, we, we collaborate with people and working with people and just getting shit done. Man. There's so much activity. It's, it's, it's amazing to be a part of it and see everything coming to a boiling point, so still. Being here, the, the entire time I've been here, right, you know, from the inception of this idea, you know, we I wanted this to be a production studio, a movie studio. There was a barbershop with a makeup room, you know, a full real sound stage for us, and it failed. The space failed as a sound stage, it just didn't work. And I was in the process of about to lose the building, COVID hit, you know, we opened 2019. So I was able to kind of shift my weight with the space and manage to survive. And then, you know, the lease became an option because we don't own the building. And the landlord was giving us issue. And, you know, not giving us issue, but, you know, it's his building. He could do whatever he wants to do with it. So that became an obstacle. And, you know, we still strong, we still sturdy. And, you know, with God, they, we, we here now. You know, we here now. And now the next, you know, decade, we're going to be here. So. And hopefully, you know, these visions are gonna to continue to come to fruition and I'm gonna stand in this building and own this building. And may this be a testament to that, baby, because that's the goal. You know what I'm saying? That is the goal, that's the vision. So. So now I'm thinking leave it, but make the nail salon the liquor, liquor store, store and turn the discount into the nail salon. All right.